So the way we've structured it now is there are four stages or we describe them as terms. So term one is get qualified. So get the qualifications, does what it says on the tin. And we'll go into that in a bit more detail in just a moment. Term two is what else do I need to know to sit down in front of my first client? Because it's all very well having the exams, but we know that there's soft skills involved. There's other technical knowledge that you need to know. Um, all the things that you, you know, you need to sit down in front of somebody confidently. So term two is skills. The next thing, term three, you're actually starting to see clients. So your downtime, if you like, your learning is either three or six months, depending if you're joining us fully qualified or doing the exams with us. So from term three, you start to be client facing. Now that might sound quite scary and it's a short period of time that you've been learning. But the good thing is at SJP is we have development managers assigned to every single person uh, for the whole duration of their training. So if they join at term one or term two, they'll have somebody, a development manager working with them. Now they are qualified people themselves. They are FCA registered and they will be responsible for the advice that you give until you're signed off as competent. So as an industry term, competent advisor status, or we call it internally CAS. So term three is all about under supervision, seeing clients. Um, they shouldn't worry about the seeing clients at the early stage because, as I say, the other person is responsible for it and every single piece of business throughout the whole academy period is goes to our business assurance team. So there'll be a second layer of checking to make sure that this advice is sound. And of course, you can use that as a learning process because if there is something missing, they'll come back to you and you'll know what to do next time. And also you'll go back to the client, get the relevant information. So term three is all about getting to competent advisor status where you're then able to go and see clients on your own. So then we move into term four. You might think, well, I'm, I'm done now, aren't I? I'm ready, I'm off, I'm out there in the world. Well, now we wanna just make sure that we've embedded other things. So you might wanna focus on a niche area. You might have a particular passion for a type of advice. Um, how do I really build my business to a point where it's now sustainable? So four terms, get qualified, get the skills training, get yourself to CAS and become sustainable. Thank you.